Good morning, Good morning Yatin. Yatin. Good morning, welcome. Welcome back, Mr. Hayward. Oh, it's great to be back. Oh. Felt as though I haven't been here for ages. No, I know, I know. We've had a, we've had a good week off, haven't we? Yeah, yeah. And, uh, but it's it's a little bit sad today, isn't it? It's a little bit of sadness, possibly, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Why, why I, is it a bit sad, Mr. Hayward? Well, I, I don't know if I'm going to be doing many more of these. No, uh, the, no, I mean, you know, as, as I'm sure you know, um, it's going to be changing uh, from, so by the time this goes out, it will um, we'll be back into the new regime of year six is here and reception here and year one here and mm. uh, I'll be teaching full time. Yeah. Um, um, and you'll be teaching my bubble. Yes. On a yes, Friday morning. Yeah. Right so then. we so, are hoping to carry on with with some good morning yet. Yeah, though, which is great. So which is great lovely, news, hopefully. isn't it? Yeah. Uh, but yeah. sadly, it means uh, Mr. Hayward. Well, for the foreseeable future isn't going to be appearing mm. but so it is quite sad that, that would um, be very sad but but maybe we you know, might find a way you we'll find know. a way definitely but anyway to 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 mark the okay i mean you know what i thought as um you know it, it's uh it's mr Hayward's last one for a bit i thought it'd be quite nice to actually you know make an effort a bit, bit more and do you know what it's it, it's remarkable you had exactly the same uh, i thoughts. know Amazing. We, we've done this so much. That I know. We've we almost started to think thought like thought processes. Yeah. I mean, and a lot of people have commented, you know, that we we are quite similar in, in lots of ways mm -hmm. and um, a bit of a double act sometimes. Oh. Yeah. It has but been said. We've been compared to various double acts. We have. We? Yeah. Some of them have been all right. Um, <laughs> anyway, did you have a nice? Um, did you have a night? Did you get a break, Mister? Yeah, a little bit of a break. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I managed to enjoy a bit of the sunshine. It was lovely, lovely over half term, wasn't it? It was. Uh, it was beautiful. Sunshine. What about you? Well, yeah, the same. I mean, it was um, beautiful weather. Yeah. Lo lovely to be in the garden. garden. Yeah. Although we did have, um, I had a few problems with my four candles. Um, but hang on, what were you doing in the garden with candles? Four, four candles in the garden. Uh, no, Mr. Edward, I was having problems with my fork handles. Not oh, four candles. not four candles. Fork. Fork handles. Fork handles. Oh, yeah. I see. Yeah. I, I got ah, You got I'm with confused. It now. Didn't I got you? confused. But yes. Do you know what? That's. Um, that reminds me of something. It does. Does it remind you of the two Ronnies? Two Ronnies. The two Ronnies. Two Ronnies. We oh, remember they, the two Ronnies, we don't do, we? We do, and they were amazing. What an amazing comedy mm. double act they were. I guess uh, quite a lot of you out there may be a bit young <laughs> to remember the two Ronnies. We're, we're, old, we're old gentlemen we who are remember the, remember gentlemen the two Ronnies. We are gentlemen of a certain but, age. Uh, <laughs> many of you children, and dare I say it, some of you parents out there uh, may I not remember the two Ronnies. <laughs> which probably makes quite me feel a very parents. old, but there we are. Yeah, but... but they were oh, great, though, weren't they? They were Ronnies. great. Um, if you've never seen the two Ronnies, look them up. Oh, uh, absolutely, and it's all available, isn't it, out there? But yeah. um, do, you, do you remember there was one particular sketch that I thought was particularly good? Go um, and it was the uh, Mastermind sketch. Do you remember that? Ah, uh, yes, I do. I do. Yes. Uh, that was particularly funny uh, because it's yeah. still, I, I think Mastermind's still going, isn't it? I think uh, so, yes. Yes. And, yes. Uh, yeah. and yeah. It's, a, it's a serious yeah. you know, quiz. Serious quiz. For isn't very it? intelligent very, people, yes, like, yes, not yes. unlike ourselves. Um, but in that particular sketch, um, it, it was particularly funny uh, for one reason. What was the reason? So, I, so I know the one you think you're, it was where one of them, yeah. Ronnie, Ronnie Corbett, it was Ronnie Barker and Ronnie Corbett, wasn't yeah. it? So, and, and Ronnie Barker was asking the questions, yeah. and Ronnie Corbett, the smaller one, was answering the questions, but he was answering the previous question. So he was giving the answer to the previous question. Right, okay. The question and, before. Right, and that was funny. It was very funny. It was funny, very funny, it? very yeah. clever, wasn't it? Very clever. Um, I mean, I, you know, it would be quite nice to have a go at that, wouldn't it? Do you we think? have a go? Do you reckon we can do, do it? Do you reckon we can do it? I think but we we'd need a mastermind style chair. Right, okay, let's see. Um, should let's we see if I'm going yet? Okay. Ah. How about this? Well, look at that. Will that do? Look at that. I mean, look what you can find in props. Just that. <laughs> Just there. The props department Just has come up ready. trumps again. Well, they have, haven't they? Yeah. And they there do that are. quite a lot, don't they? Props Master seem to anticipate our every need. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Okay. okay. So, how do you feel? I mean, are you ready for this? Yes. Good. So you're going to ask the questions. I'm going to ask the questions. And, and I'm going you're going to. Your you're going to answer the previous. Answer the question. The previous question. Yeah. Okay. That's Let's the see how it works, Let's shall see we? If we can do it. Let's do it. <clears throat> Good morning. 
Good morning and welcome to Mastermind. Can I have your name, please? Good morning. <laughs> your chosen subject is to answer the question before last, correct? Mr Hayward. <laughs> and your time starts now. What is paleontology the study of? Absolutely correct. <laughs> Who are Mr Hackerson and Mr Oakden? Old fossils. <laughs> What makes a courgette and a tomato? One is the music coordinator and one is the science coordinator. <laughs> Correct. What do Miss Plested and Miss Williams have in common? They're both vegetables. <laughs> Correct. Where might you look for the stars? They're usually found in year five. <laughs> Correct. What entirely fills your head? Space. <laughs> Correct. Complete the quotation. To be or not to be? A walnut-shaped brain. <laughs> Correct. What is Boris Johnson famous for? That is the question. <laughs> Correct. Who is Mr Froggett? The Prime Minister. <laughs> Correct. What is the fastest land mammal? A year six teacher. <laughs> Correct. Who is the most successful person in a quiz? A cheater. <laughs> Correct. Who is the head teacher? A genius. Correct. I'm thinking of the number 50. What does that make you think of? Hmm. Uh, Miss Keeble. Correct. <coughs> I've started so I'll finish. How long have you worked at Yatton? Oh, half a century. Correct. Well done. You had 16... Uh, questions correct with no passes. Thank you, Mr. Hayward. Thank you very much. Well, <laughs> we enjoyed that. We enjoyed that. Um, you were very good, actually. You managed to keep a, a straight face. Thank you. Um, Thank you. And a bit like just listening to one of your jokes. <laughs> You've been well trained. Haven't you? <laughs> and just for the record, um, we don't believe that. Um, Miss Williams and Miss Plested are vegetables at all, no, of do course we? we don't, no. They're, they're fully no. up, no. upstanding men. Mr Frockett's Prime Minister might be quite fun, though. Yeah, and, and we're still not sure about Mr Johnson, but yes. Mm. Moving on. So, uh, Mr Hayward, have you got any news for us? Oh, well, I do, actually. Funny, funny mm. you ask. A couple of things, actually. So, um, on the 5th of June, it's World Environment Day, um, which is a, a special day. It aims to raise awareness about climate change and inspire some people to take action across the globe. And this year's theme is biodiversity, which is the range of different living ecosystems on Earth, including plant and animal species. So the day focuses on, as I say, about taking environmental action. And it's been going actually quite a long time since 1974, which I didn't didn't no. realise. So Although it's, it's all these increasingly years of, useful. I mean, you yeah, know, but it's interesting, relevant, that, you, know, it? that, that, uh, that, you know, that that it has been going for such a long yeah. time, and people have been working to help improve the environment over over such a long long period. Every every World Environment Day is hosted by a different country, and official celebrations take place. And uh, and this year actually, uh, it's being hosted. By, by the country of Colombia, mm. um, and they're sort of doing it in partnership with Germany. So they're the people that are... The, well, South America is a big, you know, it's got, with the rainforest, isn't it? It's um, particularly yeah. uh, relevant to them, isn't it? Absolutely, mm. absolutely. So so um, today it's organised by the by the United Nations. Right. Um, so, yeah, it, yeah it's, it's important, isn't it, to, mm. to, to focus on the in environment and... Well, um, biodiversity diversity is particularly important isn't it and I, I did read sadly about the um, the amount of mm. the number of species that are, that mm. are on the road to extinction mm. which is terrible really isn't it, it it's, it's it's quite scary isn't it yeah. and uh, yeah, I know lots lots of you out there you know I know lots of the children lots of the families in our in our community care deeply about the Absolutely. environment and, yeah and um, got a lot of nature detectives out absolutely there, yes yeah. and that, that's that's really good. really good we and we them. always yeah we have lots of stuff come through haven't we about yeah, people absolutely. in various ways helping helping wildlife and and caring about the environment so that's 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 fabulous um, another piece of news uh, mm -hmm. recently um, is a SpaceX mission. Oh, of course, yeah. Nice. Um, which I'm sure yeah. lots of you have been taking taking an interest fantastic. in. So fantastic. So in case you haven't caught it, history has been made as two NASA astronauts safely boarded the International Space Station. 
amazing, isn't it? Yeah, so it is. And what's, in, what's special about this, it's the first time that NASA astronauts have been sent into space on a rocket owned by a private company called, called Space SpaceX. So the mission, Demo 2, launched from the Kennedy Space Center on the 30th of May. And it was the same launch pad that was used during the historic Apollo 11 moon oh, okay. landings, right. which, uh, again, we're back into a long time ago, a bit mm. like the two Ronnies, um, mm. which we the remember. The 70s thing. Yeah, yeah. So, so <clears throat> I, I, I remember yeah, when I was yeah. a little boy we grew uh, up, watching, watching some of the Apollo, um, yeah. Apollo uh, missions on, on the news. So after reaching orbit, uh, the astronauts Doug Hurley and Robert Bacon decided to give their crew Dragon spacecraft a name, and uh, they called it Endeavour, which was a tribute to the the very first space shuttle that East, each astronaut had flown. Which aboard. itself was the first reusable yeah. one, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Do you know, I heard that the um, that what was particularly amazing, or one of the most amazing things about this, is that usually... The, the stage one part of the rocket is um, burns up and is destroyed. Yeah. Because these things cost millions of yeah, pounds. Yeah, yeah. But this one actually has a burner and um, not only um, landed safely, it landed safely on a drone ship. Oh, Can really? You imagine that? It's absolutely oh, astonishing. It is. It is. It is, it it is, is I find it all mind. completely yeah, mind blowing, yeah, this, really. Um, so, so why is it important? Well, the mission is seen as being important for future exploration, um, which uh, the upcoming Artemis mission, which aims to put the first woman and next man on the moon by twenty twenty four. Wow, so that's there's not... an ambition to, to get oh, people yes. back on the back mm -hmm. on the moon again. Um, and they will follow Exciting. fellow NASA astronauts uh, Chris Cassidy and two Russian cosmonauts on board the International Space Station. So they're up there already. That, I believe yeah. so. Yeah. Because yeah. it's the Russians who currently do all the taxing. I think it? so, yes. Yeah. 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 So it's been nine years since astronauts last blasted off from American soil. Um, NASA stopped using their own space shuttles in, in 2011, but now NASA will use SpaceX as a bit like a, uh, a taxi service, if you like, to send people into space. Like an Uber. Rather than using their own rockets. <laughs> yeah, where, where would you like to go, sir? Uh, is, well, could yeah. you take me to the moon, please? Just it a is, one way. That'd it is great. absolutely incredible. Nice. Um, so originally the mission had been planned to take place on Wednesday the 27th of May, but bad weather meant the launch had to be oh, rescheduled. Oh, yeah, that's right, got cancelled. Uh, rescheduled. Yeah, yeah I remember we're, that. We're so eventually, even after bad weather threatened to delay the mission again, the astronauts were blasted off into space at, wait for this, 17,000 miles per hour. Good gracious 17,000 miles per hour, which is that's quicker than 22, 22 times the speed of sound. Wow. Isn't that amazing? That is amazing. Yeah. And their crew dragon craft flew off into space on, on that Saturday at about 20 past eight in the evening. Okay. Did you see it? I didn't, actually. No, I didn't. Did you? Yeah, I did see it. And it was um, it was incredible. I must admit, we were, we were watching telly. I know it's probably later than a lot of the children. Mm, mm. But I was fortunate enough to... And, I, and we were... Uh, it was supposed to be 10, 17. And I remember at quarter past ten, we kind of rushed upstairs and we're only just in time. So it was actually a couple of minutes early. I mean, I don't know why we were expecting yeah. to be bang on time, but it was amazing. It was like oh. a really, really bright light, yeah. like the satellite going across the sky. Um, and yeah, just incredible. Yeah. Like living history. Yeah. You know? Well, I'm sure some of you, uh, yeah. some, of the, some of our... Some viewers. of our communities, our yeah, viewers, yeah. Um, yeah. managed to see it. No, I missed it, unfortunately, but oh, amazing. I, I just find it uh, all, all oh, incredible. Oh, it's incredible, yeah. So that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's oh, the nice. news for the good, day. Good news, yeah. Well, I wonder what the um, the children have been uh, getting up to, because it's been a while, hasn't it? Yes, and, well, um, we've got a few things to share. Yeah. Do you want me to... Um, yeah, go ahead. Do yeah. I start yeah, off? Yeah, so, yeah. so, a few things that I've got to share. So, Ella, Ella from 7J. Hello, Ella. Um, Ella sent in some lovely learning, um, all on the theme of the sea, mm. the sea and oceans. There's been a lot of work on a that. A lot of week, hard work there? going in there. Yeah. Um, or oh, it's too much to, to, to read, but uh, she's come up with some really interesting facts. The sea covers 71% of our Earth. It's it? amazing. Mm. Um, while the other 29% consists of continents and islands. Um, but only 3% of 
of the water is drinkable. The rest is salt water. Wow. So I like the, um, the, you know, you get a shot of the globe. And you can, you tend to think of the globe being dotted with continents and countries, yeah. but you can turn the globe around so that there's an entire you, one yes, hemisphere. Yes, and you see just all of Pacific, that water. Oh, yeah. Amazing. So Ella's come up with, with some really interesting <coughs> facts. She's found out about some famous divers, whole list oh, there. Right. Um, she's found out about the sea and the ocean, um, that the fact that the sea is way smaller than an ocean. Um, mm. and they're normally found where the sea and the ocean meet. Um, the sea and the ocean are words used to describe all the connected salt waters of the world, but as we know, they're actually very, very different. So there's lots of interesting information here. Mm, She's found out Ella. about the Dead Sea, which can be very healing and helps with diseases, with the minerals that are found, found in there. Um, She's found out about a famous girl diver called Tanya Streeter, okay, which um, she's found out a little bit about. And and she's ended with some good did you knows. I like some good, good Ooh, yeah, did, go you, on, did you know? Did you know that more people have been on the moon? So we're back there, back to yeah. space again. More people have been on the moon than right at the bottom of the ocean. Isn't right. That? Yeah, Incredible. that doesn't surprise me. And they always say, don't they, that it's the kind of um, one of the last unexplored wildernesses. Yeah. yeah. See that Mariana Trench yeah. and things, and incredibly and, uh, deep, aren't they? And yeah. the other, another, did you know, is that less than five percent of the Earth's waters have actually been explored. Yeah. Which ties in with what yeah, you does, what, yeah. what you yeah. say. So, so much, so much deep in there, deep deepest oceans that we that we don't know that happen, I bet there are loads of creatures we've not even yeah discovered. absolutely isn't yeah. that an incredible isn't mm. that and did you know that the biggest mountain chain is actually under the water i think really i did know that that's a bit like comparing it to say the himalayas yes which we consider yeah. to be the highest range but actually it's only because it's above Water yes. level in terms yes. of base to peak. Yes, there's it? a lot going yeah, on yeah. down there under the yeah, water, no, isn't there? Thank you, Ello. Enjoyed oh, reading good. that, and yeah. lots of hard hard work's gone in gone into that. What else have we got? Um, I've got a photo here of Kirsten um, for Jay. Um, we've had a lot of that to do with pets. Oh, we, yeah. That? So, so a nice nice pet picture here, Kirsten, um, with pigs. with guinea pigs um, called Pat. And Millie. Oh, good names. Good. Millie. Yeah. I've got a Millie. You've got a Millie. I've got a Millie. Uh, a Millie dog that you might have Pat. seen in it. So Our car is called Pat. The car is called Pat. <laughs> well, there you go. So, um, actually, over going back to half term, I yeah. when, remember Millie Dog who appeared on yeah. the previous episode of, um, uh, we actually said, did celebrate her 15th birthday oh. in half term. Now that's probably so, that's probably about 126 because yeah, um, I, I, Mrs. Caffrey was in last time. Do you remember? Yeah. Her? Yes. And, um, yeah. Apparently, yeah. dogs age. It's not just like seven years. No, it's a bit if, more complicated. It is more complicated. It? So yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll check in with Mrs. Caffrey. Yeah, my my son reckons it is equivalent with a small dog of yeah. 75. Okay. But I but I'm I'm because yeah, you're looking good on it anyway. She yeah, good oh, on yeah, she had a lovely birthday. Thank you. <laughs> Right, so thank you. Anyway, thank you, Kirsten, for the lovely, lovely pictures of you. It looks as though you're looking after your guinea pigs really, really well. So that's lovely, lovely to see. Thank you very much. Oh, um, more, more creatures here. Oh, lots of, uh, lots of pictures actually, from um, Mrs. Ralphs. Mrs. Ralphs. Mrs. Ralphs. Chickens. So, uh, well, this is so. Um, some photos of the duck house, actually. Do you remember oh, the, the duck name? chickens so, and ducks? So, hoisin, hoisin and roast. Do you remember ah. the names of the, the ducks? Yes, yeah. yeah. Oh, um, and she wanted to share with us how much they, they are they are oh, growing, which is fantastic. That's, that's good. Um, and she's also sent pictures of the not-so-baby chicks. So, um, some of the photos here. Oh, All sorts of photos here of of the where the chicks are. Oh, there you go. They are ch I just call them yeah. ducks, but they're chickens, aren't they? So that's lovely to see. Nice. That, that all is going that all well in yeah. the... That's good. They grow quickly, don't they? They do. They do. Um, uh, <coughs> I think that's it for me. Well, I've got, got a few things. things. Yeah, Go I've on. got some stuff. Um, yeah. So Holly 
in my, in 9J. She's done some amazing art. Ah, work. some more lovely art. Another work. another lovely whale. There. Yes. And a beautiful watercolor uh, sunset, sunsetting of the sea. And I have to say that's oh, one that's of the, lovely. One of the nicest things is to watch the sun go down over the sea, isn't it? Oh yes. Uh, Sammy from um, uh, HA, he's been, um, there he is, Sammy's been baking some bread, which, um, for which, he must have sent that in, for which he's been awarded, jealous again, a blue pizza badge. Oh! Yeah, I mean, it's wow. an absolutely cracking loaf he's, he's made. Yeah, That's that a looks fancy like, badge, isn't it? Yeah, it is a fancy badge, and that is a, an amazing loaf, isn't it? Well done, Sammy. Um, this is nice. This is from Zach. Um, Zach has sent in, based on um, Linda's piece a couple of weeks ago, uh, about the church tower. And he's got a photo of himself on top of... Um, oh. With Mrs... Um, um, he's with his cousin, Mrs. Yes. Reddell's daughter. Right, okay. And they're yeah. on top of the church tower. So that follows on beautifully from, from yeah. what Linda was saying. But what a lovely picture? thing to have sent yeah. a, a picture in. And um, hopefully we'll be able to go up. Let's hope again. so, because it's, it's a fantastic experience if you ever get the chance to go up there. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so this is a nice one. This is from Lila and Joe, <clears throat> 6J huh? and 3J. And they were uh, at Sam Bay and they found a lovely picture of some caterpillars uh, emerging from a cocoon, a really massive cocoon. Good gracious. Uh, it's incredible, uh, hundreds of caterpillars there. Uh, and what a great wow, uh, what a great, great thing to have witnessed. Well done. I don't know. Well uh, spotted, Lila Yeah, and I know, R proper cocoon. It's amazing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is amazing. Uh, um, and again, nature detectors, um, Naomi um, from um, 7J, I think Naomi is, she has been constructing um, a bird box. Ah, right. And which is brilliant. I, I, it, great to see her actually making stuff. You can see the, you can see the bench in the background yeah. there. She's made that, and she's not only made it. It's a great picture because she's very uh, gymnastic, isn't Naomi? She's um, she's put the uh, box all into the there, tree, really. all up in the tree. Um, and it goes on. She's also made a pond. And you can see there, she's in the pond liner. Oh, before she's yeah. filled it up, which is brilliant. That's one of the best things you can do, isn't it, it is. for, for God to uh, track wildlife. And it, yeah. and it doesn't have to be a big pond, does it? No. I've, in my, I've only got a fairly small garden, but I've just got a tiny little pond, and we get frogs in there, and it's amazing Absolutely. what you can attract in a very small yeah, pond. Yeah, and you see so the birds, and recently I've seen bees coming in to have a drink. Oh. You don't imagine bees would want a drink, but they do. Oh. And and that, how special is that? Is that a slow, that, that's a slow worm. It is a slow worm. Slow worm. They, and Naomi found that in her garden yeah. too. Um, as well as another little creature, a lot of pictures. Oh. A little uh, field mouse. Field mouse. There. So oh. lots of, uh, well done Naomi, lots of um, nature oh, detecting. doing a fantastic job of attracting wildlife yes, to your garden. Yes, indeed. Which is really good. Well uh, done Naomi. And this is a fabulous picture of a very handsome dog, Floyd. <laughs> um, and this is oh, from, oh it's, um, it's Lila and Joe again. I was going to say, that looks a little bit like sand. Sandpoint. It is. It is sand, sand point, and it was. Uh, this is a, just before the start of half term, but really nice to see um, Floyd having a great walk, and nice that they relax lockdown a bit, that we can all go mm, a bit further. It's beautiful up there. It is lovely. I, I had a lovely walk up there actually, based on that. So a couple of things which you're going to see later, but um, two little film clips. Right, got. yes. One is um, Bobby and Hazel, who are regular contributors, um, as is Fraser, actually. Yeah. Um, they, they are, they're avid watchers, mm -hmm. and um, they've sent in two videos based on clips that we've done. So one was, do you remember our Star, epic Star Wars battle? Ah, who could forget? Uh, who could who forget could that? Forget? Uh, it, you hurt me, actually. Did that. I? I'm sorry. <laughs> but um, the... Um, 
so they've made uh, a film, a, a little um, scene from Harry Potter. Oh. Um, right. From The Sorting Hat. Oh, So yes. we've got that and we'll show that in love a minute. That's really hats. good. And also, Fraser, um, based on your... Um, recommendation about the mini marathon oh yes he, yes he, he's yes. done he's, he's, he's done it hasn't yeah he? he's done he's, his own mini marathon and it, it, what's really good is there are two videos one of him being filmed running it mm. and then one where he's got the he's camera got the camera attached yeah. to his chest like Annika Rice yes. running <laughs> to, that's really you're good you're showing her age again aren't you oh yeah Annika Rice 70s we've got a 70s thing. two Roddies yeah. Annika Rice uh, what else uh, Apollo, Apollo 11 oh uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so you, that's coming up, as well as uh, Emily from Class 7 has also made a little film um, to do with um, the seas and oceans. All right. So that's all included, and we'll see that in a minute. I well think, done. Really I good. think that's that. So actually, we can cut to that next. Okay. So we've got a short compilation of the videos that have been sent in. Mm. So thanks for that. We Thank really, you. We enjoy really the like video seeing clips. videos. Oh, it's really yeah, good. it's great. So yeah. Enjoy. We're doing it here at home in the garden and this is Fraser's body cam video. Mostly it. chest cam. So here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, it's quite tight. Oh, fairly tight. Oh, <laughs> I'm already running. I'm already running. <laughs> oh, closer to the edge. Man, this is tight. Ooh. Oh, whoops, 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 skipped a bit. <laughs> Down the side. Dad, you're meant to be watching me. I've got this on camera. <laughs> this is our boat and because it is dark, it cannot reach shore. What he needs is a lighthouse. This is our lighthouse and it's producing light for our boat to move across. sorting hat on your head and it will sort you into your houses. Hermione Granger. Okay, oh no, it's gonna be fine. Ah, yes, right, okay. Good, they they were Amos? good. Yeah. They were good. Well done. It's it's nice to you know to see people. I love the uh, video clips. To, yeah. Well done. Can I just say what a what an interesting shirt you're wearing, Mister? It certainly Mr. is an interesting shirt, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. And, and like nice it? to see nice to see a proper bow tie. Indeed. Yes. Now I mean the proper clip on ones are nice, aren't they? But you know it's nice to be able very, to. Very very good. And your uh, shirt. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Yeah. So that, it's, uh, they're interesting. Sort of oh, yes. Decorative. Lots of very decorative. <laughs> it's. It's. I'd, I had some old scraps lying around. Did you? Yeah. Oh, Just knocked it out. Oh. You know. <laughs> very nice. Right. Um, I think it's time for the birthdays, Mr. Is Hayward. it? Fantastic. Yeah. Okay. Right. I've got some birthdays to to share. To celebrate from the infant children. Great. Let's have a look. So yeah, several birthdays happening around now in the infants. So we've got Bronte. Class 1, Harry, Class 6, Ned, Class 8, Sienna, Class 2, Emily, Class 2, 
and Esme from class eight in the infants, all having birthdays at the moment. So I hope you have fantastic. a fantastic birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday, everyone. Happy birthday. And what about the juniors? Well, in the juniors, we've also had some birthdays. We've got Eva in class 11, Lily class four, um, Ethan class seven, Tara class eight, Anya class 12, Zach class three, uh, Nicole class two, Reuben class one, Josie class one, Jack from class two, and Lily from class two, two. So all those people in June is having birthdays. Happy birthday to you guys. Happy birthday. Having a lovely time. I hope so. Cool, excellent. Right, what's next? Dad? Well, you know, Mr. Haywood, um, in, these, in these tough times, it's always nice to have a joke, isn't it? It's nearly always nice it's to have nearly a joke. Always. <laughs> have you got any jokes? Um, I've got one joke, actually, uh, from, um, from Ollie. Yeah. Okay. So Ollie's joke is, it's a bit of those two, two, two liners, really. Okay, right. I once met a man with a wooden leg named Smith. Oh, right. Um, what was his other leg called? Oh, very good. Very good. <laughs> very good, Ollie. That's well uh, done. It's all about the order of the words in that, it isn't is, it? Yeah. Thank you, Ollie. Yeah, like that. He's good. I can see him saying it actually. Yeah. 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 Isn't that from Mary Poppins? There is something like that from Mary Poppins. Yeah, because then they that? laugh and bob yeah. around on the scene. Yeah. Oh, uh, it's funny. Very good. Thank you, Ollie. Uh, but you know, I, I've I've got a joke for you, Mr. Hayward. Uh, if I've got that a does of, not surprise me. I've got a couple of jokes. Mm, okay. Right. Okay. And, uh, yeah, so um, so I'm only familiar with uh, 25 letters in the English language, but I don't know why. Mm. OK, yeah. Did you so say you had another I've one? I've got another one. So anyway, yeah. um, so two, if you can imagine this, two, um, two antennas met on the roof. Uh, they fell in love and got married. It was a lovely thing. Um, the The ceremony wasn't much, uh, but the reception was excellent. Uh, there we go. Anyway. Uh, oh. Anyway, so... Uh, moving on then, um, shall we uh, shall we do a bit of spinning to win in? Oh, spin to win, <laughs> or spin to fling, spin or, to fling, or whatever. Right, whatever. Yes. Let's, Here it uh, is. Let's get it. Up. Oh. Let's get it up there. Shall we? As it's the last time, shall we? Shall we start off with the children and do the chocolate prizes first? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Then. So I've cut all the contributors, and they're all in there, yep. which is good. So give them a proper mix, and we'll see how we get on. So these are just going to be our eight winners. We've had the chocolate, to uh, sorry, the, the toilet roll's been quite popular recently. So I heard. Yeah, so yeah. Mrs. Cap oh, yeah. oh, oh hang on, on hang a on. Roll. That's the breaks. That's from Ozzy's birthday, let's find oh. that. Okay. Right, off you go then. So oh, right. these are okay. just um, for the chocolate prizes, and then we'll see. Good delve. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Uh, Sophie W, 5J. Oh, Sophie well W, 5J. Okay. Okay, off you go. Oh, oh, sorry, yeah, yeah. yeah. Spin. Yeah, there we go. Chocolate. Well chocolate. Done. Uh, Isaac from 6J. Chocolate tea. Chocolate again. Another name. Open it up. Oh. So I'm just going to be that. Ollie. Ollie, Sam and Isaac. Ollie, Sam and Isaac. Thank um, you very much. Ollie, so we've got three names. Ollie, Sam and Isaac. They can share it. Share the, the joint. Thing, share. Oh! oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's the, the toilet, toilet roll. roll. Excellent. And oh. I've got Adam from 4J. And he's just got chocolate. Chocolate. Well done. Uh, oh, we've got 
Natasha. Natasha from 10J. Oh, see what she gets. Oh, it's another toilet roll. It's another toilet roll. Oh, fantastic. Oh. Well done. Bonanza. Uh, and this is Sophie from Tanjay. And she's got some chocolate. Chocolate. Well done. Well, let's go. Last one. Oh. Ah, the oh. entire um, family, which we can't mention, but we know who they are. It's a family <laughs> prize, that one. A family prize. Well done. Let's do it. And some and chocolates. They're also frequent contributors. They are. Yeah, and the last one is, oh, here we go. Um, Ollie Lama, who sent the joke in today. Oh, so well, well, that's, done, that's very good. And let's see what he gets. And chocolate and for chocolate Ollie. Well for Ollie as well. well done. Brilliant. Great. Well done. Thank okay. you. Okay. Right. So now it's something you've been waiting for. Spin to fling. Spin to Who's fling. Who's going to get pie this fling. week, Mr. Haywood? I can't Wood. wait. Let's have a look. Want, it's your last go, Jordan. Yeah. Oh, so I spin? Yeah, you spin. Absolutely. Okay. Here we go. Big spin. Big spin. Oh, big spin. Who is it? It's you, Mr. Oh, Haywood. Oh, Can no. you imagine that? Oh. oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I couldn't let you get away with that. That's right. In. <laughs> Hang on a minute. <laughs> My name's on every one of these. I've been oh, done. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it was. Uh, I, 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 I'm afraid I knew, and I had. I'd stacked it, not in your every one. Mr. Hayward written on it. <laughs> Sorry about that, Miss Hayward, but I know you're a good sport, and I thought it's it was the only way we should we could really end it. So, um, well, thanks for that. It's thanks for your right. time it's here. A, We've had some laughs, haven't we? We have had some laughs. It's been a <laughs> it's been a pleasure. Every moment. <laughs> Mo most moments. Most moments. <laughs> Even your jokes. Thank you, Miss Hayward. And uh, well, we won't be seeing you for a bit, but hopefully you can come and join us. Maybe, uh, hopefully, yeah. one time we'll, we'll be able to yeah. we'll be able to come back together. Yeah, again. nice. Okay. Well, it's um, in you know in the two in the words of the two Ronnie. <laughs> <laughs> in the words of the two Ronnies, well, it's good night from me, and it's good night from him. Thank good you. Good night. Good night. <laughs>